with a papagayo parrot, we are presenting the largest retrospective of Portuguese artist uh, Osmao and Paiva, who have been working in film, uh, 16 millimeters, always no sound, uh, Cambria Obscure, that we present also, but they have also worked with sculpture and photography. But we chose the cinematographic work and uh, the projected images of Camera Obscura. And the idea was uh, that they would all be presented like one work in itself, a work made of work, so that the installation would work as a work and the sum of its parts uh, would be the, uh, what you see, what you get in, always with a stress and with a focus on the physicality of the film medium. And uh, the physicality means that the only sound you hear is the running of the 16 millimeter projectors. Uh, so really it's a mute parrot. Uh, the only sound is the sound of its own projection. Also, at, at, you always see several projections at the same time, because the idea is that we get like into the belly of the monster. We go into the inner world of the artist, and it's all like a kaleidoscope, eh, where you see this myriad of images. Eh. It's always short films, it's, uh, they, uh, except for the last movie, which is a movie, and we designed a small theater to see it. All of them, the duration usually is one roll, which is almost three minutes or maximum two rolls. So essentially, it's, uh, they, they uh, restrain themselves on purpose to uh, what is the constraints of these 16 millimeter uh, films. Their films and uh, uh, projected images uh, make us go back to uh, the origins of cinema, to the documentarian route, eh, the train passing by, or the workers coming out of the factory, or the fantastic invented world of George Méliès and the voyage to the moon. It's these two traditions together with many uh, philosophical and paradoxical references uh, united to the pataphysical uh, world of uh, Alfred Jarry and the kind of uh, philosophical dialogues, but in a, in a very humorous, almost ethereal way, eh, what we see in this uh, exhibition. The exhibition uh, has its own concourse. It's, uh, we propose a voyage into this artist world, and, uh, which has a beginning and an end. And in itself, this experience of the spectator walking, sitting, looking around, and uh, listening to the physical sound of the projectors would make this unique experience but better to look now at the trailer that the artist uh, devised to present the exhibition here.